as well as undoing steps made to a project file open in DaVinci Resolve's edit window by visiting the undo option underneath edit or by holding in the control or command if you're a Mac user and pressing Z, a history option is also available in the same menu. After opening a previously saved project file inside the edit window or a brand new DaVinci Resolve project, only original appears above open history window. Should I make changes to the project on my edits timeline by adding in a four color gradient edit and a cross dissolve video transition between this and the fusion composition, for example, if I revisit the history option once again, the higher the editing transaction appears inside your history menu, the more recent this particular transaction was made inside your project file. Simply click on the relevant step that you wish to visit, such as when I added my four color gradient generator here, for example, and we can see the project in its state once this new edit was added from the effects menu. To return to your project in its most recent form, simply return to edits and history and tick the option at the top. We can also visit the open history window, which can be resized and repositioned and enables the end user to make quick views of a particular project file in each of its stages in the edits window. The most recent transaction now appears at the bottom of this new open window. Thank you very much for watching. I hope that video was useful to you. If you enjoyed the content and wish to be notified about future uploads on this channel, please like, share and subscribe. Join me soon for another video. Take care.